Hi, Aaron Cushing with Square Thunder, and today I'm going to demonstrate how to use uh, Service T to, to automatically, uh, well, almost automatically, post on your behalf to your Instagram account. If you're not a subscriber of Square Thunder's uh, social media graphics subscription program, uh, we'd love to have you sign up. Just head over to squarethunder.com slash social, and uh, you'll see all the great uh, offerings that are there. Uh, Really, it boils down to you get uh, a monthly collection of graphics that are customized for your business with your logo, your branding on it, and that uh, you can post them on your Twitter, your Facebook, your Instagram, uh, whatever other social media channels you choose to use, and uh, you can use them. They, they look great, and you don't have to think about what you're going to post uh, or when you're going to do it because um, we're giving you all the tools that you need to make those posts and have them scheduled for you. Uh, so let's have a look at how to do this on Instagram. Uh, I'm using a page, uh, an app called Later, and uh, it used to be known as Latergram uh, when they first started out, but now they've uh, rebranded a little bit. Uh, it's called Later. The website is later.com, L-A-T-E-R, and uh, really it's super easy. Uh, it's not, as I said, it, as I said, it's not fully automated because to do so would be a violation of the Instagram terms and conditions. Uh, so they can't post on your behalf uh, in an automated, automated or scheduled way, but it makes it very easy. There is a companion app that goes along uh, with this service uh, for your iPhone. And uh, so you do need to download the later app on your phone uh, so that you can uh, use this service. But I'm going to show you how to schedule the posts and uh, it's, really easy. It takes a lot of the headache out and you don't have to remember when you need to post on your Instagram. First of all, uh, once you've signed up uh, for the service, uh, you need to sign in and I'm already logged in here. I'm just going to hit sign in with Instagram as it signs me in and we're ready to go. If you follow me um, on Instagram, I'd love it if you do that. I would be happy to follow you, follow you back. Uh, my handle is squarethunder.ca. If you head over to my website, squarethunder.com or squarethunder.ca, um, you'll see all of the links to those channels here. My basic workflow for uh, all of my scheduled posts is I keep a spreadsheet uh, for all of my posts for the month, and I do these all in a month in advance. I keep a column for the date, a column for the image name, the file name of that image, and uh, a column that has the, um, the caption that I want to go with each of those images uh, or the post and, t and Facebook or the tweet text. Um, all of those I copy and paste directly uh, from my spreadsheet into whatever app that I'm using at the time. So today we're looking at later and we're going to show you how to use this so that you can post, um, post your stuff and not have to think about it very much. Your first step here is to upload the media that you want to use and if you're a subscriber to my program you, on a monthly basis, receive a, a zip file of stuff that's already customized for you. I'm just going to hit this Upload Media button here and browse to the file or files that I want to upload. Right now I'm just going to choose one for June 3rd. Hit Open. That dialog might look different if you're on a PC, uh, but you know, you know to expect that already. Give that just a moment to upload here, and while that's doing that, I can browse to the date that I want this uh, post to occur. I've got a nice calendar view here. Uh, this is for May. I skip ahead and I'm going to post this on June 3rd. Click over to week view. And once this is uploaded, I can drag it from this bin on the side and drag it right into the week when I want it to happen. And it's going to pop up a little preview where I can write my caption. Normally I would be pasting this from my spreadsheet. I'm going to just type it in here. We love donuts. And you can type a hashtag donut day and All right, whatever you want your caption to be. And 
The images that you would receive through this subscription are already cropped to fit properly in the square format, but if you wanted to crop them, you could do so here. Next, we can choose and really refine when the post is going to occur. I'm happy with that, satisfied that it's June 3rd at 12 p.m. I'll just hit the Save button. And in just a moment, we'll see that preview um, ready to go. There it is on the calendar. And I can look at the month and see. So far, I don't have much posted scheduled for June yet, but that's okay because now it's only the very beginning of May. I do have a bunch of stuff already ready to go throughout the month of May. Now, the way that this uh, website works is in conjunction with the app on your phone. When you give the app permission to send you notifications, when, when we hit the schedule of one of these posts, you get a notification on your phone that says, oh, it's time to post something on Instagram. That pops up and you say, okay. And then it opens up in later and then it gives you the opportunity to, uh, the button is copy this post to Instagram. And you click that button and it automatically copies your caption into the clipboard on your phone and it kicks the graphic over to Instagram, pre-populates it there. All you have to do is hit paste in the caption field and post, and it's done. You don't have to do anything else. You don't have to remember what the caption is. You don't have to keep a big, huge collection of, uh, of these graphics on your phone ready to go or any of that. It's already uh, pre-populated, and it just gives you that reminder on, on according to your schedule. And that's it. It's super easy. If you're not a subscriber to our graphics program, head over to squarethunder.com slash social. You can see all the details there. It's an awesome program. I'd love it if you'd sign up. And you too could then have uh, some awesome graphics that you can post on a regular basis on all of your social media channels. Thanks for watching. I hope this has been helpful. Uh, check out my other videos. I show how to do the same type of uh, task on Twitter, and we're going to look on Facebook as well. Hope it's helpful. Uh, send me a message. Love to hear from you. Thanks.